everyone, what's up, North Collectors here. We're gonna show you a few of the cards that are in our collection. So I know we break a lot of boxes, we open up a lot of packs, but we indeed do collect cards <laughs> up North Collectors. Um, we have behind us a whole bunch of storage boxes. Uh, if you saw the video we did with Filmington, uh, I think in the background you can see them. Uh, one of these uh, shoe boxes has some of our favorite cards. These aren't necessarily our most valuable cards. Uh, they're not, you know, maybe the most rare cards that we have. Uh, but these are just some of our favorite cards. So we're going to show you a few of them uh, in this video. And, you know, let us know what you think of these. Yes, yeah, so good, sir. I have a couple. These are kind of together up top. I bought these at a national a few years ago together for really cheap, like 10 bucks a piece, 15 bucks a piece maybe. Um, just two Brady. Um, this is a select Prism Silver and Chrome X Fractor PSA 10s. Uh, these have gone up a lot in value since I bought them. Um, but they're just cool, really, really nice looking cards. And big Brady fan, so cool just to have some of his stuff. I mean, his rookie stuff is way out of my price range, but just having some of this stuff is cool. So those are a couple um, that I'm a big fan of. Next one here is pretty cool. We actually got this last year, right? In the. Um, postseason uh, well, be two years, two ago, years now, ago yeah when the red Sox won um but out of 99 this is a tops now brock holt first player to hit for the cycle in mlb postseason history brock holt is one of our favorite players for red Sox. he's this you know swiss army knife of baseball he plays every position uh he a super good teammate Cheers everybody on. Unfortunately, I think they talked about trading him or him signing some with somebody else. I think as of now, he's still on the Red Sox, but um, uh, the Red Sox are making a lot of cuts uh, to their salary. Uh, but that, he's just a really good guy on top of being a, a great uh, baseball player. So fun guy, kind of came up out of nowhere out of the minors um, and uh, has done great things for the Red Sox. Yeah, really solid player. We got a couple of dual autos coming up next. Pick this one up really cheap at a national. Um, Diamond Icons, Pedroia and Benintendi together. Two of our favorite players, love Benintendi, love Pedroia. Um, there's talk about him even possibly becoming a manager later down on the later Yeah, on the, yeah, yeah. Um, which would be cool. Um, but dual auto, dual patch auto out of 10. Just a really clean looking card. Both on card autos. Um, Really cool for us just because we really, really like these guys. I think we probably have six or seven Pedroy autos and probably six or seven Ben Tendi autos too. So. Yeah, we, we picked this up at the National after we sold our Otani one-of-one one, Panini Silver Pack a yes. card. That was an autographed uh, patch of Otani. And uh, so it gave us a little spending money at the National. So that was kind of a fun pickup. That was 2018 National. It was. Uh, next up, we pulled this one ourselves. I think this is the first card that we've pulled. Um, Jason Veritek, Chris Sale pulled this out of what series two? Uh, was it series two? I think it's series two. Yeah, nineteen tops. Yeah, this is series, right there. Two. series yep, two. Yep. Um, Veritek and Pedro or Chris Sale dual auto, dual sticker auto, but still cool. Red Sox great. Kind of before we watched, and Chris Sale being one of the better pitchers now. Um, didn't have a Chris Sale auto in a Red Sox uniform, so really cool card just to pull. Um, pull it out of our case, which was really sweet. Um, next one up we pulled as well. Really, really cool card as well. Devers is having a great career so far. Great young player. We have quite a few Devers autos as well. Um, but pulled this one out of our Heritage case in 18. On card Devers, real one, autograph. I like this picture a lot. Just a cool looking card overall. Yeah, the blue ink, obviously the coveted red ink. Uh, those are super tough pulls. We we're just happy to pull a guy we collect. Uh, and we put that, of course, in our PC. And it's more special to us when we pull it and get to keep it. And, you know, obviously guys like that, those are the type we like to keep. So, Yeah, next up here we have a Andrew Benintendi Orange Freshman Flash on card auto out of 25. Another card that we pulled ourselves, um, got this out of our 
first chrome case that we ever did bought a chrome case um it was an insanely good chrome case it had a aaron judge orange 87 card which was worth a ton of money it was like right at judges it was peak. like 300 hundred dollar card at the time um pulled a soup super fractor out of that case um our only super fractor that we've pulled to this point and this as well so really fun case um really good memory we we're actually opening we brought boxes with us to a campground, and we're yeah. opening boxes at a campground. It was a on straight a fire at night. Yeah. And it was just crazy. So yeah, it, yeah, and the uh, case was incredible. Unfortunately, we we did not have our YouTube channel at that time. So no, that would have made some amazing videos. Uh, next one we pulled as well, a Kenny Galladay, ten out of ten Vertex patch auto. Got this out of a Vertex box from the National. Bought one a few years ago to get. I think he got like seven silver packs with them. Um, so that's pretty cool. Really nice, like, Lions patch. I mean, he's turned out to be one of the better Lions players recently, which is really sweet. So really cool card, just a nice-looking patch auto. These capstones are pretty cool. So, Yeah, beautiful card. Great wide receiver for the Lions, and uh, hopefully he's going to continue to improve over the years. Next up, another Devers auto. I think we bought purchased this we one We bought somewhere. this one, and we bought a redemption uh, on eBay for around, I don't know, $30 at the time. And uh, obviously this has increased in value significantly. Um, beautiful card, numbered to 250 so not the lowest numbered, but I like the purple. I like that the look of the parallels of those years, of that year, excuse me, because the, the color really pops on them, especially in the chrome. So. Yeah, they do look really cool. Um, next, this is one of our... This is, might be my favorite card. I yeah, know. it might be my it's favorite, there. too. One, one um, of mine. Just because yeah. of the memory of it. Um, so Noah Syndergaard. I mean, I'm not a huge... I mean, Nolan Ryan, Noah Syndergaard, obviously two amazing players. Um, not like a mega fan of either of these people. Don't have a single other autograph of either of them. But it's just such a cool card. Heritage dual real one auto. Nolan Ryan, Noah Syndergaard. Yeah, I mean, for me, a little more special. I watched Nolan Ryan pitch as a kid... Uh, obviously one of the best pitchers of all time and we pulled this out of a loose box that we bought at a hobby shop in a random hobby shop and we pull it out and there's a redemption we're like no way um and then we got it back from tops it took a while but it was fun to get back in the mail uh so you know th that's the fun part about that and so next up here um another really really sweet card our only Trout Auto, Mike Trout Sticker Auto. And this is from the National two years ago. Um, we got there, got the Otani autograph, one of one, like the first night we were there. Sold it there for quite a bit of money and then bought quite a few Tops boxes, got the packs. Waited to get home. I actually have a video if you want to go check it out and see us pull this card. Probably our most viewed video. It was like 26,000 um, yeah. views or something on it. A lot of views. Um for a good reason, because Trout, amazing player, and amazing pull out of those packs. I mean, to get a Trout auto, yeah. there's only three of them in the whole set. Right. So three out of three. Uh, just a really, really cool card to have. I mean, one of the greatest baseball players of all time. So pretty sweet. Another one that we pulled here, Tim Tebow, rookie auto. Um, I was a huge Tebow fan when I was a little kid. Watched him in college um, a lot. Really liked him. Was hoping he'd do great things in the NFL. And he did, actually did pretty good before he... I don't know, things just kind of went downhill. Um, but cool card, Triple Threads, we, Rookie Auto. We bought this box from a uh, Black Friday sale from Blowout, I think it was. And we were hoping to pull some kind of Tebow card, not expecting to pull the patch autograph. So that was pretty sweet. Yeah, next one here is a John Smoltz 10 out of 10 coin and stamp autograph. When they made this, I don't even know what what set is this. 20, 2015? 2015 update? Tops Update. Yep. And they made these, and we always wanted to pull a coin and stamp card. And so we were like, oh, I think we have one. Because we'd hear the coin jiggling around trying to be autographed out of 10, which is pretty cool. So. Yeah, that's a sweet card. Just a cool. And yeah, and John Smoltz. I mean, Hall of Famer, uh, great uh, player for the Braves, great pitcher. Uh, watched him play, of course, too, in those great Brave years. And, uh, you know, really fun card to pull. Never pulled anything like that since. Yeah, no, I mean, a 1967 stamp and a 1967 coin in there, too, which is pretty cool. So another card here. Pick this one up, a Kirk Cousins autograph. Um, big fan of his. We're both state fans. So cool to see him play in college. I actually played, like, high school football 
Yeah, down the road down from the, us, yeah. about an hour and a half away. Uh, you know, good guy, good uh, good player. Obviously, you know, I've, people have different opinions of him, but um, there he is, Kirk Cousins. Yeah, it's kind of a cool card. Picked that up really cheap, too. Picked up before he was um, good, so... Next up, got a Bodie Miller autograph. Great skier. Even cooler now that I ski, too. Um, really cool. Pulled this one ourselves as well. Was Grew up kind of like 45 minutes away from where yep. I grew up in New Hampshire. So 7 out of 60 on that one from the Olympics cards. Got another Olympic card, too, up next year. Michael Phelps, athlete-worn memorabilia swimsuit. Um, got this card a while ago. I don't exactly remember. 2012 tops out of yep. 50. Pulled it out of a... Blaster, Pack, I think. Yeah, yeah, blaster. So that's pretty cool. Once again, maybe not the most valuable, but definitely a great memory, a cool card of ours that we like to show off. This is one of my more favorite cards. Um, Zach Ertz, so pretty good player. Um, nothing like insane, though, but still pretty good player. One of the best tight ends in football. Um, we got this. We opened up a ton of Topps Prime. Not a ton, but we really like ah, Topps Prime. Fair amount. We opened yep. up quite a bit of it. Every time, I hope we pull a booklet. We need to pull a booklet. I want to pull a booklet. I always want to pull a booklet. Like this <laughs> and one time we open up a pack, we're like, oh, it's a booklet. And turn out to be this. And we've kept it ever since. Yep. Um, really cool card. Love Topps Prime. Um, the card's just cool. I mean, the pink, football, glove, just a lot of cool stuff. So really sweet card. So there you guys have it. There's some of our favorite cards from our collection. Yeah, we'll try to do another video like this and uh, let us know what you think of this one. Uh, let us know what your favorite card is that you saw in the video, and we would love to hear more from you and love to have you continue to watch our videos. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks to all our subscribers. Thanks to uh, all our regular viewers. We appreciate you all. Uh, take care. Have fun collecting. Please like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you in the next video, guys.